Good morning, welcome back. It is Thursday. Hope your day is going great. It's almost the end of the week. Got one more day to go after today, then we'll be here to a weekend, but we will not be any attending any racing activities as most of our tracks around here have shut down for the season. Anyways, you tell by the title what we're going to open. 2018 Panini Donruss NASCAR Racing Blaster Box. Picked these up a few months ago on Steel City, I believe it was. Or it could have been Blowout, or it could have been... It could have been any number of sites. I haven't bought on any of the sites in a while, mainly because... I've still got quite a bit of stuff to open, and just trying to save a little bit of money. So, that's why we've been doing, like, the Hero Card videos on Monday, and trying to go through some of the other items that we have, just to, you know... You know, it's nice to be able to once in a while go out and, and buy stuff, but... Holy smokes, for a while there, we were racking up some bills. But anyway, talk about it. 2018 Dale Jr. on the cover, or the, I guess it's the cover, whatever you want to call it. Uh, one auto or mem card per box. Still looking for a slingshot. Haven't pulled those yet. Get some rated rookies over once in a while. Sideways Dale. Uh, again, we talk about it all the time. This orange background white printing. You know, works out pretty good. I think it's pretty clean. It looks nice for the zoom and scroll. And there is our earthquake ripping through here as I uh, got the bump the camera base. Usually the hit is right there, so we'll move it to the back of the pack. And all these packs are pretty thick, but that's because they have 10 cards per pack. Ooh, Potential Spam is calling me. Does anybody know who Potential Spam is? We're not going to talk to them right now. Been dealing with them all day. Been dealing with them for quite a while. But uh, that's another video for another time. Going to start off with Reed Sorensen. When he was with Premium. I think Premium got out by... Who'd they get bought out by? Like Rick Ware, I think. Because there was three or four of them really, really field filler slash back of the pack teams that all kind of merged and premium was part of that ryan blaney in the championship four for penske gotta remember we gotta keep an eye on centered names and name variations so we got kyle larson also in the championship four mtj is not but we have a numbered dale jr name variation 126 out of 199 and that would be looks like the red so put that in the numbered pile. Ty Dillon. So we got our Dillon out of the way in the first pack. Hirsch McGriff, Hall of Famer. And we get two Dillons. Two for the price of one. Austin is now in our first pack as well. Bobby Labonte, Legends. And Paul Menard, 85. Baseball throwback there. So we'll go to pack number two of six. I keep thinking that these are going to have the uh, game card or code card on the back. But they are not. Justin Allgaier starts us off. He's in the championship four for the Xfinity Series. Jamie McMurray. Clint Boyer is next. Jamie McMurray. We have Greg Alding. I thought that was a relic for a minute. We talk about that all the time. That Rocket Man card. That I don't know why he has an empty patch there. That makes no sense whatsoever. Thought it was a relic card when it was turned over. But we got a name, or not a name variation. Yeah, that's a name variation. David Reagan. Legends. Derek Cope. We talked about that picture before. Taken in 1988. Alex Bowman. And name variation. Eric Jones. Rookie of the Year. ROY. This pack will put us halfway through our rip today. Kyle Larson once again. That was probably my favorite target paint scheme, or one of them. There's a couple that look really nice and a couple that didn't. Matt Kenseth, Jimmy Johnson, Michael McDowell when he was with uh, Levine Family Racing. We get a nice William, William Byron Phenoms insert. Of course, William in the championship for as well. Then we have Derek Cope, Legends Richard Petty, Eric Almarola, Dale Jr. name variation, and Brad K. Looks like he's at Charlotte, perhaps. 
They used to paint their walls yellow. It's part of the Nextel Flash Sprint branding. Pack number four starts off with Denny Hamlin, who missed the championship four by a handful of points. Another Ryan Newman with that horrible drop shadow on that lettering down at the bottom that makes it difficult to read. Matt Kenseth. Matty D. Now that's the way that they should have did it on the yellow ones. It's not as bad. It's still distracting, but it's not as bad. So with Jimmy Johnson, top tier is probably going to be a cracked ice because those are the usually ones turned around backwards. And it is, it is a numbered card, 380 out of 999. It's actually a pretty decent looking card. We'll put it back there with our numbered cards. Slice bread, Joey Logano, name variation, Eric Jones, Kenny Wallace, Legends, Kyle Petty, and Matt Kenseth. Of course, the name is centered here, so that is a picture variation. Also, blue has a different color back as well. Maybe. I can't remember. It probably does. A.J. Allmendinger got his first career win driving for JTG Doherty at Watkins Glen. Ryan Blaney got his first win for the Wood Brothers. Bubba Wallace, rated rookie, not a rookie card. Of course, we talk about this all the time. Uh, where Panini's taking a lot of liberties with NASCAR rookie cards. David Reagan. We have an insert. Of how, how strange is that that our inserts, the current and the previous driver of the 24 car? Chase Elliott there. JJ, name variation. Jamie McMurray. Bill Elliott. Daniel Suarez, former Xfinity Series champion. And name for photo variation centered name Ricky Stenhouse Jr. So now we get to our hit pack. So since it's not a thick pack, one of two things, well, one of three things is going to happen. One, we don't get a hit, boo. Two, we get points, less of a boo. Three, we've got an autograph, which would be exciting. So there's a card that's turned around backwards. And feels like it's probably going to be points. So Donnie Allison starts us off. Ward Burton is next. Then we've got DJ. I'm going to put this on the back side just so that I can when I flip it over here in a minute. Danica Patrick. Race Kings of Dale Jr. And we got Ty Dillon. So we've got two ties. One Austin. We have Brad K. We have a Joey Gase. And then we have whatever this card's going to be. I think it's going to be points. No, it's not, is it? I don't know. No, it's... So... So it looks like it's backwards if it's got the number going that way. And... Okay, there's why it didn't work. Sorry, I'm grabbing from the wrong stack here. I got two stacks of these cards... Really, Panini. So we got MTJ. And it does have an autograph back there, so let's see who we got. Signature series. Can't really tell KN Pro series. So that could be any number of drivers. And it is Spencer Davis. That name rings a bell. Don't really recall much about Spencer, but I definitely do not have an autograph card of Spencer Davis. Born 11 29 98 So he's got a birthday coming up at the end of the month. Looks like he was in the next program, perhaps. Again, some of you guys may be able to brief me up on Spencer Davis. I don't have, I'm thinking maybe he might have ran a few truck series races, a few Xfinity series races, but nonetheless, 
We did get an auto. It is not numbered. But to get an auto in a blaster is always a good day. So there you go, Spencer Davis. But I'm sorry for me, car of the day is the Jimmy Johnson top tier. Even though it's numbered out of 9.99, uh, very military looking card. Plus just that that cracked ice. There's not a lot of stuff in the back to really distract from. So Jimmy Johnson cracked ice card of the day. Not very often autograph gets beat, but sorry Spencer. I mean, I don't really have a lot of history of you, and, you know, it's kind of a bad autograph, too. So, anyway, thanks again for watching. Really, really do appreciate it. Make sure you hit that like and subscribe button on your way out. We'll be back at noon for Fast Packs. I think we'll probably do another pack of 1990 Fleer Baseball. Seems to be pretty popular right now. So, as always, thanks again for watching. We will see you later.